How many people like chaos? How many people love chaos? How many people hate chaos? How many people know what chaos is? In a relationship world, you need to know what chaos is. Do both of y'all sit down and decide what chaos is? Or is chaos understood from what chaos does? Chaos. Chaos equals losing. Um, there's no chaos in Christ. But if you don't believe in Christ, then that doesn't matter. Chaos we're talking about is people who are responsible for chaos. It's not the leaves. It's not the trees. It's not the wind blowing. It's not the sunshine. It's the people that are responsible for the chaos. Can you wave your hands if you're responsible for chaos? Or do you think it's always somebody else? Chaos is people running around with their heads cut off, not knowing what the hell is going on. Chaos is somebody who strategically maps out a plan to disrupt something. Chaos is somebody who designs, probably a low-level student, designs a concept that creates the discomfort in people that are good. Chaos, chaotic past, chaotic present, chaotic future. The chaotic people who won't call themselves chaotic want to marry somebody who's non-chaotic, who's peaceful, who has their life together. You want to jump on a bandwagon like a leech, like all of these people all of a sudden just pick the favorite sports teams to cheer for. At one point, everybody was cheering for Golden State with Steph Curry. I'm a Golden State fan. Now we don't got no more Golden State fans. So now the Philadelphia Eagles and the Kansas, everybody, I'm a Kansas City Chiefs fan. Bandwagon jumpers causing chaos. Is anything wrong with that? I guess not. I guess you don't have to stay with who you picked or who you think. But this monkey branch jumping thing, uh, the hillbilly said that in his presentation, and it was a good one, about how women, and we can just throw men in there as well, or whatever we want to call us nowadays, will jump from person to person whenever there's a, a stench of chaos, they're ready to bail, ready to jump off of that ship, off of that branch to another one to avoid chaos. Has anybody ever thought that you are the chaos? You are it. If everybody tried to eliminate themselves from being chaotic, relationships will have a chance to work. Love y'all. Kill the chaos.